Like another new student is confused with the walk humbly part of the code scripture. At just leave love, kindness, walk and walk humbly with God. Walk humbly with God, that, what does that mean? Let's go read it! Hi, welcome to our school. How are you? I'm confused. That's what I am. What does walk humbly with God mean? Hmm, tough question. Do you have any easy questions? Nope. Okay, let's give her some examples. Imagine this! How to be humble when playing soccer. Imagine your team works together to pass you the ball. You score, but then... Yes! 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 That's not being humble. Everyone think you're self-centered. Being humble looks like this. How to be humble on the monkey bars. If two people are going in different directions, how can you be humble? Get up! I was here first! Oh, wait, I was here first! Nah, that's yeah. not right. You should offer to let the other person through. Unless you both have the same idea. <laughs> How to be humble when only one can go at a time. What if two people want to go down the slide? Fighting isn't being humble, but letting them go before you is. Remember to thank them if they let you go first. How to be humble when finding a seat to sit with. If two people sit down at the same time, pushing the other person is just plain mean. Be the one who stands up and offers a seat to the other person. How to be humble with academic achievements. Imagine the person sitting next to you gets 9 out of 10 on their spelling test and you get 10 out of 10. Comparing your better score with theirs is not being humble. What'd you get in your spelling test? Nine out of 10. It's so bad. This and neither is making a public spectacle about how good you are. Yeah, 10 out of 10, let's go. This is bad. Yes, yes, what? yes. 10 out of 10, yes, look at me. Instead, be encouraging. Lift others up before yourself. That's really good for a grade one. Good job. You'll get 10 out of 10 next time. Wow, did you get 10 out of 10? You must really have done your homework. You too. You did a really good effort. You got 9 out of 10. How to be humble when going through the door. When a group wants to go through the door, don't walk them out. No, 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 no. Put the door open for everybody and let them in first. Yeah. 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 You did the best. How to be humble when playing basketball. You're enjoying a great game of basketball. You realise someone is sitting on their own. Hang on! Look over there, someone's left out. Wait, should we let her play? No, no way. No, we've got enough players. Yeah. Okay. Fire, pass. Oh, what a wasted opportunity. Hey, Being humble in this going, scenario is letting that person join the game. Hang on. Look over there, someone's left out. Should we let her play? Our team's pretty full. Oh, that's okay, guys. She can get on and I'll get off. Go and show it how it's done. Yeah, look! Oh, that, that was, was amazing! Oh, oh my god, how did he do that? That was the best thing I've ever seen. How to be humble 
when you're in the audience. If you're in a group that's watching a performance, don't look bored or disinterested. Also, don't make it all about you. I can play better than that. Where are you going? Where are you going? Or refuse to clap when others are. Instead, make eye contact and really listen to the performers. Make sure you clap when they finish or say something encouraging. Brilliant! But the best example of being humble is... I know this one by a man named Jesus! Not only was he God's son, but he was selfless. He was caring. He was compassionate. He was righteous. He was perfect. And he was humble. And this humility was shown when he died on the cross to take away the sins of the world. Jesus thought of the world first before himself. He paid the ultimate price for us all so that we could be forgiven. If we think of others before ourselves, we are following Jesus' example. And that is what it means to walk humbly with God. And action! What did you get in your spelling test? No, I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I'm off it. <laughs> action! You did very well. Uh, I feel close. <laughs> <laughs> <It's> okay. <laughs> when you're ready, start again. Well, I'm... <laughs> <laughs> and action! <laughs> anyway, I was looking the wrong way. <laughs> what are you like puzzled about? Or are you confused about anything? I'm confused about my skirt today. Well, my skirt are very confused about that as well. Maybe we can explain it to you a bit later on. Okay, hang on, wait a sec. All right, go. My goodness, that was so good. How did they even learn that in like two years? I don't know. That was so good. <laughs> that was really good. Keep going.
No, so encouragement. What would you say? You, they just finished no, playing six, and six. go. Oh, brilliant. Um, <laughs> but are you still filming? Yeah. <laughs> Action. Wait, should we let her play? But the best example of being humble is... I know this one. I'm by a bear. 